One week ago, President Biden said inflation was temporary. He went on to say that spending trillions more would, and I quote, reduce inflation, reduce inflation, reduce inflation. Madam Speaker, I think he's the only one who believes that. Mr. President, with all due respect, we need to wake up. Inflation has risen every single month since you took office. And last month was the largest increase in 13 years. Now, let's be very clear. Inflation is a tax on every single American. Everyone who's buying grocery knows it. Everyone who is filling up their car knows it. Everyone who is booking a summer flight knows it. And yet President Biden told a town hall in Ohio last week, I don't know anybody who's worried about inflation. <laughs> Madam Speaker, the only people I could imagine who are not worried about inflation make $5 million in a couple months on trading stock options or sell paintings for half a million dollars. Why doesn't the President of the United States know what's going on? This is what Americans hate about Washington. They turn on the TV and hear the President telling them their concerns aren't real. Enough is enough. People are fed up with the ignorance and arrogance and the hypocrisy. Madam Speaker, President Biden needs to get a clue about inflation. And it's not just Republicans who have been warning the Democrats if they passed the bill, it would bring inflation. And here it is. It was Democrats who served in the Obama administration and Clinton administration who warned them if they spend more trillions, inflation will come. And it's come every single month. And what's their answer for the future? More trillions. They probably even try to call us back in August to make sure inflation grows a little more. If that's not enough, just yesterday, we missed every indication and every prediction for growth in America. Americans can't take this much longer. November can't come sooner. But inflation is a tax on every single American. But for those who don't know it, spend a little time with the real America and you'll realize it. With that, I yield back.